Hi everyone, this is Hannah from TaxDome. Today, I'll be showing you a new feature called conditional sections in organizers. Conditional sections allows you to show your clients a very small number of questions with the ability to show additional groups of questions based upon client responses. This is the same idea as conditions to questions, but on groups of questions. So for example, I have here an organizer entitled, did you sell any property this year? And in this section, you can ask one probing question. Did you sell any property this year with yes or no options? If yes, then the client will be shown an entire section with all these questions. A free entry question that says, what is the property address? A number question for what was the sale price and what was the purchase price? A radio button question that says, was this property your main residence for at least two out of the last five years? And a file upload question that says, please upload form 1099. But if they answered no, then this entire section is hidden. To do that, Click the gear icon next to the conditional question. In this organizer, this section that says, please specify the details, is the conditional section. This is a section that you would like to show only for some clients. Now let us click the gear icon. An expanded box will appear, toggle the conditions on, and under the condition section, Select the section that will impact the displaying of the conditional section. Click back. Once you have set it up, you will see the green conditions indicator next to the conditional section. Hover the mouse to see the section that impacted, it or click the question title to jump to it. All questions that impact the conditional ones have the impact indicator next to them. Hover the mouse to see the conditional questions that depend on it, or click the question title to jump to it. Conditional section is visible on your side, but it's hidden from the client's view by default. Once triggered by the answer to the other section, that would be the time that it'll be visible on the client's organizer. Let me show you how it looks on the client's side. So let us save this first. And let us send this organizer by clicking the plus new button from the left sidebar. Select organizer from the slide out menu. Select an account. Select the organizer template and click the create button. Now we are currently in the client's account and let us check how it works on their end. So this is the organizer that they need to fill out. And as you can see, the second section is not shown by default. But if we answered yes for the did you sell any property this year question, that would be the time that the client will see the second section. But if they answered no, then the second section would be hidden. And that is how conditional sections in organizers work. Thanks for watching.